They say that British Columbia is a land of a thousand microclimates. There's nothing a meteorologist must hate more than when you have some guy who's sitting up in the mountains and he's saying like, I feel the weather, man. But, uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> but I mean, I that is that. true. But seriously, not true. It's hard to forecast for a thousand microclimates every day. Enter Joey Only, the creator of the Interior Weather and Wilderness Watchers, a Facebook group he created six years ago that has grown to a community of almost 7,000 followers and contributors. Joey first became terrified by weather after he was struck by lightning at the age of five. By the time he was struck by lightning a second time at age 20, yep, you heard that right, Joey had caught the weather bug. Sure, it's self-taught, but I spend time watching university level lectures on YouTube and whatnot and talking to people like you trying to get the, the, the real scoop. I think like talk about what you know. So, I mean, I've, I've been on the land my whole life. It's kind of this only child thing where I, you know, my friend was the forest. So I, I spent time in it and, and I have things I've learned and want to communicate and, and speak about what you know. I think I decided to take it to this next level of, of doing more YouTube and more video because uh, there's such a need for it. That's when he started this Facebook group where members actively post reports, questions, pictures, and forecast daily, more if there's active weather. There, there's a need for, for reporting here in the, the Caribou and Prince George areas. You have a lot of people who live up here, and when they turn the TV on, there's just not really often something being said to them directly about what to expect in their backyard. And, and where are they posting from? Probably going to have snow in Wells, Barkerville, Horsefly, Hickson, Alexandria, Skeech, Blackwater, Quinnell, McLeese, PG, Stoner, Red Rock, Bear Lake, Anaheim Lake, Williams Lake, Green Lake, Adams Lake, Elkley Lake, Moberly Lake, Monty Lake, Bushy Lake, Nimple Lake, Christina Lake, Deese Lake, Beaver, D Francois Lake. Stump. There's a lot of places here called Lake, man. That was the world famous Frankie McDonald he was chatting with, by the way, YouTube forecaster from the East Coast. I have the privilege of forecasting the weather for British Columbia, but I don't have the capacity to hone in on every microclimate. But day to day, as is the case for life in general for the BC interior, people help each other out. And that can be a snow report, an interesting article on the season ahead, or thoughts on an impending storm. And in turn, those reports really help us meteorologists out. The more verification we can get on an event, when did the rain start? How much snow? Was there flooding? The better our forecasts will get and the better our micro forecasts will get. And there's a lot of people who work in the bush every day and they just, you know, they just want to know like, what's, what's it going to be like out there today? And, hey, Joey's saying, you know, if you start hearing, uh, seeing dark clouds at three this afternoon, you know, there's going to be, and sure enough, by 11 o'clock, they're out of touch with the world, but then Environment Canada's throwing up their weather warnings and weather watches and they didn't get to see that. All they saw was me blabbing as if, as if I know something. So thank you for sharing my passion and keep those weather reports coming and we will continue to learn from each other. And now you're science smart. If you have a science question on your mind, send me a tweet and I'll try to get it answered.